going on YouTube, you know what I'm saying? Welcome back to Car Reacts. You feel what I'm saying? I hope, I hope everybody's having a great day, you know what I'm saying? I'm here with my lovely uh Twitch viewers right now. If you don't got me on Twitch, make sure you go to the description down below and go watch it. Today, we are watching The Rise of Kai Sinet. Hey, I don't know if this is my first... I don't know if this is my first uh documentary, but <laughs> yeah, we're going we gonna to see. Let's, let's get into it. Blown up on YouTube is a goal a majority of small creators aspire to reach early on. Uh -huh. But it is not an easy goal to reach without hard work and perseverance. Many Definitely. give up early on, but a select few have the mental toughness to keep keep going when views are almost non-existent. For Kasanet, he's one of the few who I think was destined to blow up on this platform. From buying his first camera to becoming one of the fastest growing creators on YouTube. It's far going into today's video, we're going to look into the rise of the one and only. Kai Sinet. Yo! Just cause it's on YouTube, lol. <laughs> I, I muted. I think I muted the donations. But yo, look how I look, bro. Who remember this? I'm about to cry, bro. Yo, bro. Oh my God, the skits. The skits. Oh my god. Boy, like, it's like, oh. Ding dong ditch. Fanta with the cannon. Yo. Yo, one person that I'm really thankful for, bro, is Phantom, bro. Like, Phantom, bro, he didn't, bro. Bro, I can't wait till me and, like, bro, I can't wait till me and Phantom was on top, bro. I swear to God. Like, Phantom, bro, that kid Phantom, bro, like, he's a real nigga, bro. That's all I gotta say, bro. One of the realest niggas I've ever met, bro. Dead ass. AMP, my first AMP video! <laughs> I love my brothers, man. I see y'all tomorrow. Let's go. I see y'all tomorrow. My birthday, that was re that's recent. This is recent. Kai's story starts in a borough of Brooklyn, New York, where he was born on December 16th. Holy fuck! He did some research! For those who don't know, I was actually born in, in Brooklyn, for real. I was actually born in Brooklyn, for real. For those who don't know, I was, like, legit born in Brooklyn. Like, legit. Like, I was, I was, I was, born, I was born in Brooklyn. If you guys didn't know. But, I don't jack that. I'm from the BX, though. I was born in Brooklyn, but I was raised... In the BX, so technically I'm from the or from the X, you heard? 2001. Happy belated birthday, by the way, bro. Kai lived in Brooklyn up until the third grade where he would move to the Bronx. Kai enjoyed the Bronx a lot growing up as How you know that? I did move to, I did move when I was in the third grade, bro. What? The post of Brooklyn and his love for his hometown was still the same. Before starting YouTube, Kai was originally an entertainer, finding interest in doing comedy skits in the eighth grade. <laughs> Oh, my throat is itching. We have allergies, yo. I know when y'all have allergies, y'all be doing that. So stop. If we do that, you have allergies. Spam facts. Spam facts. Oh my god. Whoa. My eye. My allergies is killing me right now, yo. I didn't have this shit all year. Now I got it, yo. Early on, Kai didn't care for views or likes as much as he did out of the love that he had for his craft. He posted his first skits on Facebook and just like almost every new creator Facts. on social media, the progress was slowed up up until one video went Facts. crazy. The hey. video was titled, My nigga, no matter how much you think you're grinding, no matter how much you think you're putting out, my nigga, bro, that is going to pay off. It's going to take one video, bro. And you know how much videos I've been posting before that and I wasn't getting no views, no nothing. Bro, listen to me. If you want to be a YouTuber song, no matter how much songs you come out with, it's always going to be that one song to make you viral. It's always going to be that one video to make you viral. Keep fucking grinding. Bro. Keep grinding, bro. All jokes aside, bro. Keep grind. I don't want to see nobody giving up. I, I don't want to see nobody giving up, bro. Especially y'all. Those who watch me, I do not want to see none of y'all giving up, bro. Bro, keep grinding. Parent-teacher conferences be like, 
which Kai posted in the 10th grade. So, you're trying to Oh Kai. my god! He has a lot of this, potential. This is the first video that I actually blew up. Yeah, this is correct. I know you yeah. like that. But, your son is very, very, very disruptive, disruptive in class. class. <laughs> he doesn't do any work. He fools around with his friends. No, what? no, no, no. He doesn't no, do no, any no, 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 no. All he does is laugh, giggle. Uh, like, he does not. He, he's very disappointed. I want him expelled. Oh I'm going to talk to the principal. No. I'm going to talk to all the deans. He gets kicked out every single day. He loves to cut my class. He doesn't do any work. This relatable video has over 3.2 thousand reactions and 270 plus comments today. Shortly after this video gained traction, Kai will see more success after posting a video of him and a fellow comedian slash good friend Ron Suno, Suno my brother. In Times Square. My brother. More than anything, Just don't like this that. is where Instagram came into play. Kyle wasn't a fan of Instagram initially due to you only being able to post pictures and short videos, unlike Facebook, which allows users to do both but at a larger scale. After eventually making the switch, Kyle transferred almost all his old supporters and more to Instagram. Now, cause niggas is really deep. What about my niggas got the swindle game? Niggas swindle game you at 110%. Yo, they really sit there and text you on call and be like, Good morning, my queen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 be safe while you outside. <laughs> Y'all niggas be doing that, bro. Y'all niggas be doing that. Are oh, you ready? You ready? You ready? You ready for this one? You ate yet? <laughs> Hey, y'all hey, niggas be doing that, bro. It's something about you that makes you so different. Like, I just I just can't put my tongue on it. Like, you're just so beautiful in many ways. And I just love the heart that you have and how 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 thoughtful you are. You are very open-minded. You're very, like, like ambitious about what you do. You're very determined. You're, you're just an like, independent female all around. Like, I, I really <laughs> love you. Like, I, I, I'm sorry to say, but I really love... <laughs> Yo, I think that was my grandma's hat. Look at, like... This hat belongs to my grandma, I think. The tag wasn't even offered. She didn't even get to wear it. I had to grab it for a skit. My fault, G-Ma. Yo, I want to give my... Yo. <laughs> yeah, I... <laughs> he would keep his trend of funny skits alive on Instagram, interacting with various celebrities such as Lil Dirt, G Herbo, Nicki Minaj, and A Boogie with the hoodie, to name a few. Hey, shout out to celebrities, bro. I got, I got retweeted by Nicki Minaj. G Herbo seen my, my thing, Blueface seen it, A Boogie seen it, bro, the, um, bro, skits really bring, like, traction to, like, celebrities and shit that, like, you feel me? They, if you funny, they gonna fuck with you. His Instagram currently sits at over four. Oh, wait, hold on, my webcam, webcam, hold on. We good? We good, webcam? You, you went out just now. We good, webcam? I bet. Y'all can see me, right? We all good? Y'all can see me? 400,000 followers today. After understanding the formula on how to expand an audience, Kyle will start YouTube. Kyle said that created his YouTube channel on December 26, 2012. That's how you know I've been doing my research, bro. When I tell you I've been on YouTube since, bro, since 2012, bro. I'm going to tell you how to order OGs. I used to watch Roman Atwood. Wasabi. Roman Atwood was my, Roman Atwood was my favorite YouTuber growing up. Like, all jokes aside, bro, there was no other YouTubers competing with him, bro. Dead ass. Then I was like, I bet. Let me just start YouTube. You know what I mean? But his first YouTube but, but, upload but, wasn't until yeah. January 13th, 2018, with yeah, a that, video titled was My, my first, first YouTube Video, in which he explains the basis of his channel. Now, for those who do not know me, my name is Kai, as I said in the video. Hey, should I react to this video? Should I react to this video after this? And I am a yes, comedian, slash entertainer, slash actor, slash oh whatever. My God. If you haven't seen my videos, then. Um, um, yeah, I'm shit. I don't know what to say. Kai has watched YouTube since he got his first phone, observing the energetic personalities of various creators. But well, I've been watching it, I've been watching it for mad long, and you see all these YouTubers mad energetic doing this, that. Yeah. I'm like, and they, and I, I know, like, they do, they be doing crazy stuff yeah, on yeah. YouTube. So I'm like, yo, that's crazy. Like, he would often get DMs from his supporters suggesting he take his entertainment to higher levels. Yes. Kai would consider these suggestions and aim to have a professional style Thank in all of his yes, videos. Yes, thanks to This move started with purchasing his first camera. Yes. A Canon PowerShot G7. All my beginners out there that always ask me what camera you use, 
What? How can I start YouTube? All that. Me personally, I started YouTube professional. Like I made sure to get like a a, a laptop and a camera. But all my YouTubers out there that's just starting, get your motherfucking G Seven X Mark Two and go crazy. G Seven X Mark Two, get it and go crazy. I. Next, Mark II. Using his camera and all of his early videos allowed new viewers to gravitate to his channel and ultimately subscribe. Wow. Most small YouTubers run into almost the same problems on their journey, such as learning how to edit and wow. design thumbnails, tagging and titling videos, and more tedious things. And just like a majority of successful YouTubers, Kai was self taught. He wow. would sit for hours searching and practicing how, how to do various that? things relating to YouTube. The only person that really knows the amount of pain oh. I really be putting in is like my roommate and Kai. Mm. Like he'll come shout in. Shout out Bach. Bach, Bach in here. Bach. He'll come in. Um, Bach is in here. That's my roommate. He'll, he'll shout out Bach, by the way. Yeah, shout out shout Bach. Out Bach <laughs> man. But he'll see me. He see me on the um computer. Like mm. he'll come in from, from wow. one class, see yeah. me on the computer still editing. Or like he'll wow. go to sleep. And I'm just coming out. W A K W A K Louds. Like wow. I'm talking like three, four o'clock in the morning. Wow. Like yeah. I'm really trying to put in the pain. And mind you, the next day I have classes. Yeah, yeah. So like it's be days where I gotta edit and I gotta do classes. But and you're I gotta doing pass, it. And I'm doing it. Yeah. Like, that's just that's the crazy part. Like I'm really maintaining there was on time. W in the, the chat, spam the W's in the chat. He says spam the W's. Right, right, right. I gotta post every single day until Christmas. Wow. Damn. And I, but I got college, like I got school. <laughs> But I'm doing it though. I'm like, yeah, yeah. yo, like, yeah, 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 if I yeah, could yeah. do this, I could do anything. At the time that Kai started YouTube, he would post videos not worrying about views or subscribers due to him having his passion for entertainment and acting as a main priority. It was in September of 2019 that Kai would start to take YouTube seriously and would begin to see results trickle in. Kai's reasoning behind putting YouTube first as opposed to acting was the enormous platform and the revenue received for uploading what you love to do. Wow. Kai was never in it for the money, just for the opportunity to interact and build a family on YouTube. One of the main things that separate Kai Sinet from other creators is his creativity and originality. Wow. His most trendy videos were from his extreme ding dong wow. hit series of videos in which he and his friend Dez would knock on various people's doors Yo. and run away before they answer. His first video of this kind and- Shout out Dez, bro. Shout out Dez, bro. Shout out Dez. And, and, bro. Bro, when you actually get the time to sit back and watch your pro your progress, bro, like me watching this is like, wow, like, you feel what I'm saying? This is crazy. Involved doing this at the college that he attended, Morrisville State College. Part one of the series, which was uploaded on September 21st, 2019, has almost 300,000 views wow. today. Oh my god, I missed it on this, bro. Bro, look at all the people down there, bro. Look at all the people down there, bro. Like, the, everywhere was lit. Like, the, like, bro. Oh, shit. He wanted to get it on. Wow. The all around series is enjoyed by many of his subscribers with the reactions wow. it garnered from students and tenants who fell victim to these pranks on camera. His most viewed video from the series and the most popular on his channel is part three, wow. which sits at over 1.4 million wow. views today. Wow. Wow. <laughs> run, run! Stop, 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 that nigga was stop, waiting stop, at the door, the, the, the people. Me, bro. Oh, man, you too much, bro. Damn. 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 Yo, you want a bad time with us with that one? Yo, relax. He just can grab me and stuff. He grabbed me. Kyle would branch out from uploading this series, digging into his creative bag and uploading consistent bangers. Now let's talk about how he came around to join the fire team of content creators known as Enemy Profits or MP for sure. had an idea of who Agent and Davis was oh for God, playing 2K and watching their videos already. It was actually Phantom who recruited Kai. 
The GOAT. The GOAT. The GOAT himself. Bro, Phantom, bro. Bro, the nigga seen... The nigga seen... Bro, imagine you grinding on YouTube, bro. And he was in my inbox like four months before I seen his DM, bro. And he just seen the potential. Like, before I hit 100K, he said, yo, bro, I see something in you, bro. We started cooking up. We started kicking up. He said, I got friends in Atlanta. We got it. Word, I, I want to see how you do, bro. Ever since then, the rest is history, bro. AMP shit, bro. Shout out to him. Tried to join AMP, he would eventually be sold on how far interactions on YouTube stretched. So, so Phantom, Phantom had uh, told me, he was like, he was talking about y'all, so I heard about it. Actually, before Phantom even mentioned, mentioned you guys, the first person I knew about was you and... Yeah, uh, I used to watch 2K videos. videos. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, but I, that's when I used to like play video games heavy. Mm -hmm. Like, I watched 2K, you, um, I watched 2K for you and um, Davis, where he do like little dribble moves and best... Stuff like that for my, mm, my players and, and stuff my like court. that. Yeah, and yeah, I'm always yeah. to switch it up, switch it up, switch it up. And I, that's, I, I knew y'all heavily about that. Davis. Phantom came to me and was like, yo, I, um, I'm in a group called AMP. And I want you to, like, uh, I, I'm trying to tell them about you. And uh, I was wondering if you, like, like just um, watch what we got on the, on the channel and see if, like, you're interested. Yeah, and, yeah, like, yeah. Um, long story short, I was watching, I was watching. Yeah, yeah. And then he said, Are right, yo, you gonna fly out with me? Yeah, yeah. Like next month or whatever. Uh -huh. Which I did. Remember when I first came? Yeah, yeah. And then after um when I did come, when I did come, it was like when I did come, I'm like, oh, this this is this is when I really like like realized yeah, like yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, this YouTube shit is for real. Like before I wrap wow. this video, I wanna point out Kai Sinet's most notable wow. accolades on YouTube wow. and social media in general. Kai has a social media wow. following of 500,000 with a little over 450,000. Wow, he bro. has one video on his channel with Wow, over man. Wow. This is this is this is great, bro. This is great, bro. 2 million views and several that are on their way to reach that mark very soon. And last but not least, he had a photo shoot in a private jet for his 19th birthday, wow. which is an unimaginable ex bro, like what, bro? I would have never thought. Chris in here? Wait, let me let me let me VIP Chris real quick. VIP Chris real quick. Wait, what? Slash VIP. I'm going to go ahead and VIP. Hey, why well, I can't see my stuff no more, bro? Bro, why well, I can't see my stuff no more? Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on, y'all. Hold on, y'all. My fault. I forgot. I'm, I'm, this is the whole YouTube video. My full YouTube. That's something, man. Yo, listen. If there's oh anything God, you want to do in life, oh, you could do you. it. If you want to tell me a year ago that I'll be in a PJ right Chris now, comments, a private so I can see jet, you VIP, taking Chris my comments. birthday pictures, I wouldn't believe it. You feel what I'm saying? Kai is fully dedicated to YouTube, allowing his dreams to become a reality. Mm -hmm. With hard work, consistency, and dedication, he has shown that anything can be possible in life. I wish Kai nothing but the best I in wish, his future I wish, ventures I wish as he you soars on YouTube. But the best. Now, if you made it this far into the video, make sure you comment down your favorite Kai Sinet video. And if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit wow. that like button, hit that sub button, and turn those post notifications wow. for me. It's Fargo, and I'm out, man. Consistency is a big thing. Like, just do what you do. Anything you want to do. Wow. You do Absolutely. You got to put in the pain, though. That's the thing. Wow. Wow. Oh, I like this, but I never watched it. I see. I think I see like the first, the first like I don't know. No, I seen a snippet of it. I swiped up and liked it. I already knew. I didn't watch the. I never watched the whole thing. Yo, that is crazy, bro. Subscribe to him, bro. Yo, that is, bro. What? 
I love y'all so much. If you guys enjoyed the video, smash the like button, smash the subscribe button, and tell me what else I should react to. I love y'all, and thanks for coming.